February, of course, is Black History Month, and in celebration, we are shining the spotlight on a local entrepreneur and her new endeavors. Today, we are talking all about black hair care and how Naturalicious is helping out. Here now with more on her inspiring journey and an upcoming book launch is Beauty Boss and Naturalicious founder, Gwen Jameer. Gwen, thanks for being with us. Thank you for having me. I'm absolutely excited, so excited to be here. Of course, so were we. So first, tell us about Naturalicious. How did the brand get started? And I've heard that you actually started this brand with 32 bucks in the bank. Is that true? I did, oh. yes. Naturalicious started officially eight and a half years ago in my basement. I was a single mom at the time. I had just gone through a very nasty divorce. Um, suddenly was thrust into becoming a single mother. And I had to find a way, and, oh, by the way, and I also lost my job 30 days before my divorce was final. Oh, wow. So that's how I ended up in a pickle of having $32 in the bank. And in that moment, something said to me, okay, you don't have the luxury of doubting yourself anymore. You have to figure out how to survive. You're either gonna fail or you're gonna succeed. And so I took my hobby of creating hair care products and beauty products for myself and turned that into a business. And there's a whole story in between there. It definitely wasn't an easy journey. It definitely was not simple, but it did get done. And we've been here for eight and a half years and now we're in over 1200 retail stores. Super proud to be Detroit based and it's been a wild ride. So when, you're, when your back was really up against the wall, you took a risk, put it all in, and it sounds like it's really paid off. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we've been able to do some amazing things. I mean, we've been able to survive the pandemic, um, which was crazy. We've been able to launch into different categories. We primarily started as a hair care company, but more recently we started expanding into different categories such as beauty supplements and skincare. And like you said, I'm even launching a book pretty soon. And so it's been so gratifying to be able to not only create a business pretty much from nothing, but then also to see the life changes that I've been able to create in our clients and our customers and the inspiration I've been able to give to other young entrepreneurs coming up, it's, it's been amazing. I wanna talk about the book now because you have a launch coming up. Why did you feel compelled to write the book now? Because the business has been going strong for several years. Why was now the right time to write the book? That's a great question. So for years, my primary goal has always been educating people, particularly black women, about how to properly care for our hair. There's a lot of misinformation on the web. There's a lot of just flat out wrong, just bad information about how to care for our hair. The problem is that a lot of our counterparts have been wearing their hair, quote unquote, natural all their lives right? They haven't had all these chemicals and things like that that they've been putting in their hair. However, for us as a community, a lot of us are going quote unquote natural in our 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, and 60s. So we're having to relearn all this stuff that we didn't learn in our formative years. And it's really hard when you go, on the, you go online and you get information that says, oh, silicones are great for your hair. And then another blog says, no, they're terrible for your hair. And then yet a third one says, oh, silicones are okay as long as they're used in moderation. This it's like, well, if I've got all this misinformation and stuff coming around me, I'm just kind of grabbing at straws, trying to put pieces together and hope that I have the right concoction for my hair. And the problem is that the vast majority of black women are going online looking for this information. And most of this information is rooted in products. And although we are a product-based brand, my, my whole goal has been, let's talk about educating you. Because a lot of us feel that we are at a loss. We feel like we don't know what to do for our hair. We're spending tons and tons of money on products that never seem to work for us, and we have no control over this. And I'm here to say with my book, Everything You Know About Hair Is Wrong, The No BS Guide to Having the Hair You Want, you actually have a lot of control over what your hair looks and feels like, and that's the part that's missing online. How well are you caring for your hair? How much nutrition are you getting? All those things are super important. And the title really gets right to the point. Everything you know about hair is wrong. So when is the official, official launch, Gwen? And where can people pick up your book? Yeah, the official launch is February 13th of this year. And you can pick it up on Amazon. You can pick it up on our website, which is naturalicious.net. Either one of those two places, you can find, our, find the book. And before we let you go, where can people learn more information about you and Naturalicious as well? Absolutely, you can find more about me and Naturalicious at www.naturalicious.net. You can also follow us on Instagram at naturalicious underscore beauty. And I have hundreds of hair care education videos that are not meant to sell you anything. They're literally just to educate you on making sure that your hair, you know what to do properly for your hair on YouTube. Just search for Naturalicious on YouTube and you'll find them. Gwen Jameer, CEO and founder of Naturalicious. Thank you so much for being here. It was great to talk to you. 
Absolutely. Take care. You too.